Hello guys and welcome back. Oop, I walked into a pillar to another episode of Lego Harry Potter Years 1 to 4. Now, let me tell you a little story about this episode. This episode began many moons ago on a day called yesterday. Yesterday was a fine day. I went to work. I came home. I sat down. A wizard walked past me and I decided to record. I recorded yesterday the next level we're gonna see here. I also recorded a cutscene that you're gonna miss because it doesn't play anymore because I've already seen it. Basically Harry and Ron, not Harry and Ron, Harry and Hermione even land on Buckbeak there. It's really that that was it in the cutscene to be honest. Anyway, my day continued in the recording where we rode Buckbeak. In this next cutscene, which features Buckbeak taking off, three Dementors attacking, Hermione and Harry falling, sliding down a roof, and landing on a tower. You'll see the following taking place now. I hate to say I told you so. We now begin the level called the Dark Tower. We collect these studs, hit these flowers, hit that, and for the fourth time in this level, I'm gonna go here, and do this, and do this, do this, do this, and do this. We are then gonna fiddle with this light, and hit this thing, which is gonna be a one of five. We're going to zap this Dementor over here, boom. We're then going to run over here, there's going to be another lamp to hit. There we go. And I bet you all my money that a pickaxe will pop out of this chest for us to break that ice whiz. I was correct. I now have all my money still. Or something. <laughs> I don't know where that one was going. Anyway, break the ice. Break the ice. Break the ice. Break the ice, break the ice, break the ice, break the ice, and break the ice. We're then going to cast Lumos, get rid of these vines here, quickly switch back to the Patronus, and kill that Dementor. The Dementor down there that you can see attacking that child, we can't do anything about him. He just exists, we have no way to reach him. I tried many times to jump off this roof here and attack him, but it doesn't work. We're then going to go over here, we're going to hit these flowers and this cobweb. We're going to hit this flower many, many, many more times. Until it gives us its delicious, delicious studs from which it contains. We're going to hit this light here. And now we're going to proceed and collect three purple studs. You heard it. Three purple studs. There's number one. There's number two. And the third one comes in just a second here. After we do this barrel. The first time I recorded this, I was very excited about those purple studs. Second time, not so much. Third time, I couldn't care. This time, they just exist in the world, really. I really have no care whatsoever about purple studs anymore. We're then going to hit this bush. Hit that cobweb. Collect this stud. And redo the slide, because apparently I forgot about it. You think after the many times I've played this level, we would not need to do that anymore. We're then going to hit that flower, hit that flower, hit that flower accidentally and hit that cobweb. We can hit this other flower as well. We're then going to proceed to jump up on these fans. And there's the other purple stud. Let us grab it. And jump for it. We're then going to hit this Dementor, if we can. Excellent. And hit this light here. This is going to give us the Hufflepuff Crest. Ravenclaw. I was incorrect. Damn. Anyway, let's grab those. And hit this cobweb over here. And we'll hit that. Why not? Okay, let us build this. I don't know what's beyond this point. You see, for these witches... They freeze the game. Something about their animation just outright freezes the game. Completely. 
And we need to get through there to pass this level. There's nothing we can do. I also didn't have access to the internet yesterday. My internet broke. But apparently, if we put Hermione over here, and if we're quick enough... Okay, I think we need to get Crookshank out, so Hermione waits long enough over there. If we are quick enough... We can hit that and switch back, and the animation can play out. Okay. That seemed to work. Good. Now we have to hit the second one as well. Okay. So let us get Crookshank back out. Switch back to Harry. Run, 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 run. Jump up here. Hit the second one. Ooh, okay. Didn't quite do it there. Let's get... Uh, Hermione back involved here. Put Hermione right back in that corner. Get Crookshank out. Crookshank over there. Run, 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 run. Hit and go. I believe I did it good enough. Okay, that witch has definitely turned, and the ice is definitely gone. Fantastic. So basically, those witches, when they perform their animation, Game freezes. Completely. Outright freezes. Nothing you can do. Like, can't Alt-Tab, can't Alt-F4, can't bring up Task Manager, nothing. You can't do anything. And the only way I got the game to shut down was by actually logging off and forcing the game to quit. And I couldn't, I didn't have to log off completely because, like, Audacity, um, as it was recording, was like, hey, are you sure you want to actually log off? Um, but yeah. Basically, I lost all those recordings I did three times yesterday. Finally, we got it to work. I don't know what's beyond this door. I'm kind of scared. I don't want another game-breaking bug. <sighs> anyway. Okay. Looks like we're uh, somewhere, at least. Oh, by the way, Sirius has been taken up that tower as well. That's uh, another thing that happened in that cutscene that you guys missed. But anyway, let's see if we can actually do this level proper now. I'm rather excited. Grab that guy. Can I... Like, if I go in this chair, does that do anything good for me? No. I don't know why you exist now, to be honest. Get that cobweb. Boom. And some more studs. Excellent. We're already at True Withered, so I don't know why we're doing all this. <laughs> the game froze for a slight little second there, there was a little hiccup in the frame rate, and that scared me. Anyway, let's move that over to there, I assume, okay. And... Hit that guy. Uh... Oh. You just came back. Okay, never mind, we'll just go around here then. Okay, I hit that lamp I think too. Let's go around here, over here, over here. Oh, that's gonna get rid of the, the vines, okay. Alrighty, and then we'll have to go back here, back here, back here. Not sure what that um, pixie's doing there, to be perfectly honest, but okay. We'll grab this, put it over yonder jump and go okay bump bottom bottom we'll hit that even though all the studs are gonna drop down off the ground so we'll not be able to get them but anyway oh yeah both of them did good job there studs and we'll build are you for real let me go all the way back around this are you are you for real, game? That's terrible level design. That's really bad. Oh, careful. Alright, let's do that. Uh, hit this chair a couple more times. Oh, that wasn't the chair, that was something entirely different. Okay, whatever. We can't hit that thing. Um, we presumably don't have a key to get into there either. Because we're not a goblin. But ok. 
Okay. And... Oh, now you're gonna build the other bridge. <laughs> really game. Really. Anyway, right, let's go through this door, I guess. Okay. Please no more. Oh, wow, so many flashing arrows. Oh, it's all with the silver birds that I can't do anything with. So whatever. Mm, please not do that, thank you. Boop. Aha, we're making a potion. Potion of strength, I think. Judging by the ingredients. And judging by that uh, handle that we have to pull there, I believe I'm correct. Oop, sorry, Mike. Let's get back to another spell that we like more than this one. And... Nope, 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 nope. Please don't do that. Please and thank you. Please and thank you. There is something definitely down here that we can ooh, ooh, do. Am I going to get any sort of that? No. Okay, what was the point in that? Oh, careful, money. Oh, there's you. Oh, I can do stuff with you. Oh, I can put you over there. Oh. Okay, my apologies. <laughs> I broke your window. Is that a... I was going to ask if that's truly, but I don't think it is. Kind of looks like her. But why would she be here? Ah, uh, we need Hermione for this. Doop. Doop. Done. Okay, another potion green there, and a Gryffindor crest. Nice. Up, 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 up. Uh, I don't think I actually have the cauldron now. Oh, it's up there, okay. I can get that. In. Thank you. And oh, that's that's Crutchink. Oh, dang it! Are you real? Where they go? Oh, it's there. Got it. It's flashing and disappearing. And I guess this is gonna give us the last one here somehow. Oh no, it's gonna give us an axe. I guess to chop down the tree. Okay. Fair enough. I can do that. Okay, that was a. Interesting way about going about getting that. And in. Potion of strength. Oh! 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 Hang on! Harry! Save the day! Thank you. And I guess Hermione needs to pull the thingy. No more game breaking bugs, please. That's a fun bridge. Okay, I guess we'll need Harry because they're going to be dementals over this side, I think. Yep. Gotcha. Boop, boop. Alrighty. I don't know if there's anything around there. Okay, we're meant to go up that way, presumably, so let's have a quick peek. Okay, there is a, is a stud. That. I was talking about this uh, in the episode, or in the, the recording that you never saw. I guess it was part of this episode still. And the texture, or the castle looks really badly textured in the game here. It looks really expansive, but the texturing is so bad. Look how poor that is. I guess that's the, uh, the grand staircase here. It looks like it has... Well, maybe not. It doesn't look like a double doors office there. I don't know where that would be. That kind of looks like the great hall to the left there. But again, it's too high for that. Hmm. Interesting. Anyway, let's uh, ascend the stairs of madness. Ha! Oh, are you serious? Is a boss demental? Jesus. Can I not just hide in this thing? Oh god, go away. I hate that you can't just tap it to get rid of these guys, you have to actually target them proper. 
No, go, go away, please, and thank you. Oh, go dog, go dog, go dog. Uh oh, I see one of those witches there. That's an issue. <laughs> I don't know if it was the witch animation or the melting ice animation that caused the issue. Can't let the Dementor get near me. Thank you. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Harry died. Oh, we're going away now. Okay, let's grab that thing then. Okay, that didn't do anything, but you can go away. And you can go. Nope, nope, nope. You can go away. Okay. And you can go away. I'll hit all those things, no problem. Ah, god dang it. Stop. Okay, I might need to have to hit these witches here. Uh, let's run over to the side, let's kind of blind fire at them. Then maybe we won't need to see the animation. <laughs> Hopefully that will... Nope, sit trying. Run away. Okay, blind fire at the witches. Ah, ah, don't let me show you. Don't show it to me. Okay. Oh, there's stuff in there. Okay, nope, 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 nope. This level sucks. This level sucks really bad. Stuff in there, too. Okay. Um, blind fire at the witch again. Nope, 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 nope. I don't like this level one bit. No! Stop! Thank you. No! Stop! No! No! This is not how the Patronus is. You just kind of fire it and good stuff happens. Go away. No, don't do that to me either. Oh, we've been turned into ice now. Oh! Oh, you use them to melt the barrels. I understand, okay. Boop. Boop. Okay, got, oh, got scared of the animation there. Right, so I'll turn this guy again. Nothing in it. I presume you need to overturn the other guy as well? Nothing in that one either, though. Like, what do you want me to do from here, game? Hit that as well? I need to melt. Oh, the the thing of the plunger on his face. Okay, I understand now. I guess what? <laughs> okay, so it's actually such a breathy, breathy breath, breath, and get you, get you, get you, get Hermione in the process. Get you. Nope, oh, Hermione, get out of the way. You and you. Okay, it's actually such a breathy, breathy run, run. Nope, turn to ice, okay. Let's hit that witch. Oh, nope, I'm stuck on the barrel. Hit that witch, okay. Overturn. Oh, he's got a plunger in the face. I think we're good. Boom. Is that it? That was it, okay. <laughs> that was anticlimactic. I don't know how he got the plunger in his face, though. Yay! We saved Sirius! We saved a murderer! Yay! We're now fugitives! Aiding and abetting! Yay! We're not even mid teens yet! I'm already criminals! <laughs> Salute! Never complete! I never thought I would complete that level. But I'm glad I finally did. That's gonna be annoying whenever we have to go free play that level to get past that little stupid bit with the witches there. God damn. True wizard. 100 I know. Stud total. Oh, I'm at 3 million? I might be at 3 million. 79. 80. That's nice. Continue story. I'm at 3 million. Are we gonna see the end of the cutscene? Oh, this should be end of uh, year 3. Oh, Lupin's. Still gotta be a werewolf, I guess. Bye. Oh. Now bye. <laughs> oh, 
Okay. The hell is that? Oh, is that a new broom? Did I get me a new broom? Oh, I think I got one from Sirius, didn't I? Maybe? I don't remember. <laughs> I don't think that's real. Credits. Uh, we're going to watch these at the end of year four. 37.4% complete. Oh my god, it's amazing. Introduction again. It's so weird that it does the introduction after every every year there. It's so weird. It's like it was made to be four separate games. But it wasn't. I'm pretty sure this was made as like one continuous game. Grab these studs, as we always do. Meet the twins again. Boop. And boop. Oh, we're at three minutes! <gasps> right three minutes, guys! They don't care. They don't care. They don't care. Let's continue the story. Begin your four. Sure. It may put me in a level. We may not have enough time for it. Oh. I wouldn't go that way, Mr. Mugman. I wouldn't do that. No. No, I. Mm. See, I would leave at this moment. I would. I would turn around and leave. The <laughs> <Bound the string. laughs> Why would you do that? Why, Milkman? Why? Uh oh. Was it a milkman in like the movie in the book? I don't <laughs> I don't think it was, was it? <laughs> and baby double was cute. <laughs> oh snap. Hello. Also hello. Yep. To the I know, I understand. We're going to, uh, the place. The, uh, the Quidditch World Cup. That's the one. That's a cool little boot. Grab on, Harry! Why did you wait around? <laughs> Do we destroy, destroy Lucius Malfoy's tent? That's funny. Haha! <laughs> <laughs> -ha. This is the longest cutscene in existence. Uh oh. Oh, well, presumably not even gonna like get the game or anything. That's disappointing. We don't even get to see the game. Uh oh, oh, now we're going to into the, into the level. Okay, I think I don't know how long of a level this is, but I think we're gonna call this an episode here um, because I don't want it to run into the middle of this, of this uh, level here. Um, but as always. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I shall see you in the next episode of Lego Harry Potter Years 1 to 4.